you've got loads of food to show you, including the new bizarre bars from the Chocolate Fist, celebrating the 4th of July American special. I know we're, yeah, we're sort of like approaching August. It's fine. There's loads of other cool stuff. Great. <laughs> Hello everyone, welcome to another shopping vloggy haul thing, a haul video, food haul video, where like I say, we've got some chocolate smith stuff, I've just been to Aldi, so I'll show you a few cool bits that we picked up from Aldi, and we've also got a Taste of the States order arriving today too, so I'll, I'll uh, get the old camera set back up for that. First of all, the chocolate smiths released some 4th of July special chocolate bars, this is a special American pack. So I picked up these, uh, we have got the 4th of July Cupcake. This is probably my most anticipated one. As you can see it's white chocolate with vanilla frosting and shortbread pieces. So that's going to be insane. We have got Fruity Loops, which is white chocolate with chocolate chips and American fruity cereal. And finally we have got Triple Chocolate fudge cake which is fudge brownie chocolate and toffee sauce in triple chocolate so yeah all of these sounds immense um, I'm not sure if they're still available I think they I think they're definitely like they're on sale as I film it I think but you might want to go on their website and see if they're still there if they're not grab some of the other flavors all of their stuff is incredible we've got lots of reviews on the channel about them cool right I won't go through everything that we got from Aldi, but I'll, I'll, I'll show you the stuff that's worth mentioning. First of all, I got this, it's, just a, it's bread, right, it's just bread, but this is the White Bloomer. This is their award-winning bread. So look, one like grocer awards and stuff. It is amazing, it's like £1.9 for this massive Bloomer. It's good quality bread. I'll be utilising this one, two, three, yeah. I'll be utilising this in BLTs. Uh, we're going to Whipsnade tomorrow. So we're contributing BLTs to the picnic. You can check out what happens at Whipsnade in our vlog on Theme Park Life. I'm not 100% certain it'll be up yet, but it might be, and if it is, it's there. And if it's not, there's like a picture of a mongoose or something. There probably won't be mongoose there, but. Can of Coke, I, I said I wasn't gonna show boring stuff. So they've got a new ice cream at Aldi, which is birthday cake. It is vanilla ice cream with strawberry frosting and cake pieces. So that should be quite nice. It's obviously along the lines of the Ben and Jerry's one. And we've got a few other ice creams in there. So I thought we'd stock up on the old waffle cones. In fact, I'm gonna get this in the freezer now because it is melting like a... This is a massive product recommendation. This is the Four Seasons Skin on Fries. Uh, I'm not joking, these are the best oven chips you can buy. They are delicious, and I don't know how they're as good as they are. They are, they're sort of borderline restaurant quality, like like decent skinny fries from a pub sort of quality. They are absolutely brilliant, and they're like £1.49. Massive recommendation, guys. I still think the gastro chips are probably slightly better from McCain, but, Gastro chips are more expensive and they're actually a lot less consistent. These are always perfect. Uh, the gastro chips, a bit more tricky to cook and like I say, they are inconsistent. So maybe these are the best of all time. I'm really happy for y'all. I'm gonna let you finish, but Beyonce had one of the best videos of all time. Of all time. The next thing is these takeaway, Carlos takeaway fries. Uh, these are supposedly new. I think they're a pound. They're in the chilled section at Aldi, and I'm extremely intrigued by these. I mean, like I said, I've just been talking up there. They're like frozen chips. These are chilled chips, and I'm very intrigued to see if these are actually any good, because I had their garlic bread from the same range, and I was quite impressed. So, yeah, I'm hopeful for these. I could check fillets. Are we having fillet steak one day? This, But, I mean, that sort of feels like, oh, that's boring. You're just showing off that you can afford fillet steak. Um, fillet steak is a lot cheaper at Aldi than it is anywhere else, so. Saved all the money on the chips anyway, didn't we? And saving money by having a sweet and sour jar. I haven't had one of these like cooking jars in literally years. Um, probably since we've lived here, we've not done one of these jars. Is that true? Certainly not a sweet and sour one. I haven't had, we, like, we never get Chinese jars, but I just really fancied it this week. So we're going to pimp it with a bit of orange juice and I'll probably, um, 
use like a corn flour slurry to thicken the orange part of it. Uh, and uh, we've got pineapples, so we've got big big chunks of pineapples instead of the small ones that will be in here. And we've also got cashew nuts as well. So yeah, hopefully it'll be pretty nice. And last but by no means least, I didn't actually get this from Aldi. I went to B&M beforehand to see if they had those new M&M's and Snickers peanut butter, which they didn't have. They said their delivery was in, but it wasn't unpacked yet. So it might be on the delivery. I might go back later and see. But yeah, shame. But uh, they did have this, which I've been keeping an eye out for. The Unicorn Milkshake Strawberry Candy Floss, which is pretty interesting. So glad to get that. Right, if I remember to do a clap intro on the a Taste of the States portion, then I'll clap that bit in here. I remembered. Wasn't well, sort of wasn't expected. Anyway, the Taste of the States haul has arrived, so like I said earlier, use Fruck 15 for 15% off, and we did not pay for these products. Let's get into it. Like, so excited for these. This is Nutter Butter Cereal. Um, apparently, these are even better than Reese's Puffs. I think it was Zach F that said that recently. Um, yeah, absolute excitement. Reese's Puffs is basically, I think, the best cereal ever made. And this is a peanut butter cookie cereal. And Nutter Butters themselves are absolutely amazing. They're like a peanut butter flavour sandwich cookie. So yeah, extreme excitement on this. We have got Cherry Vanilla Coca-Cola. Again, love Cherry Coke, love Vanilla Coke. I, I, I just think I'm going to love it again. So yeah, super exciting. I'm not sure about these. This is Herve Dippin' Dots Cookies and Cream Snack Balls. So love Dippin' Dots and I quite like the snack balls but the, the Herve Snack Balls have been very hit or miss. Um, I sort of love them, I sort of think they're a bit bland. So I, I, I'm sort of thinking it's going to be the same thing with this but I'm still very intrigued to try them. We've got a freebie, well like I said I didn't pay for any of it but you can expect to get little freebies thrown in like this, there's a blueberry dum dum lollipop. We have got, I was so glad that these were back in stock because I was fearful, I was trembling uh, that I wasn't going to be able to try the Pop Tarts Fruit Loops flavour. Absolutely love Fruit Loops and to, to imagine that flavour in a Pop Tart, it blows my mind, it really does. We have got Sour Patch Kids Tropical with Passion Fruit, Tropical Twist, Pineapple and Paradise Punch flavours. We have got some classic Swedish fish because I, oops, because I enjoyed the, the singular Swedish fish that I had the other time. This is going to be interesting, I've never had American Betty Crocker chocolate chip cookies. So we've got a chocolate chip cookie mix there, you need butter and an egg. Very easy. Don't have eggs. Can't make them like immediately. Not that I would make them now anyway, but irrelevant. Cool. Penultimately, we have got Charleston Chew Rollers. I absolutely love Charleston Chew. They're basically like, it's like a chewy soft nougat, sort of pretty close to the Barrett or um, Candyland, formerly Candyland, now Barrett, um, nougat that they do. And these ones are vanilla flavour coated in chocolate. And this is a ball variety, so snacking on the go. Or snack to go, as it says. And last but not least, by no means least, I guess, is the phrase uh, Flips birthday cake flavour coated pretzels. I have had these before, and they are essentially mind-blowing. So I thought, yeah, let's, let's get a bag of them in because they are so good. Right guys, I think that's it for the haul. So what, we did Audi, B&M, Chocolate Smiths and a Taste of States. So yeah, bloody good food haul today. Thank you for watching. Check out our other channels, including Theme Park Life, to see what we get up to on a day-to-day -day basis when in coronavirus times. Uh, of course, it's called Theme Park Life, so we hope to get to the theme park soon. If you enjoyed the video, please click like and have a good time. White chocolate. <coughs> Oops, sorry. Oh no, I've got, I've got a bubble in my throat. Oh my god, oh my days. This is a ridiculous bubble.